From the river to the ocean Getting bigger, growing strong Everybody's on a journey Come and join us and swim along The river is where salmon go To spend their days once they are born At three years old they're not so small And then they hear the ocean call From the river to the ocean Getting bigger, growing strong Everybody's on a journey Come and join us and swim along from the river to the ocean, getting bigger, growing strong. Everybody's on a journey, come and join us and swim along. The salt water out in the sea gives salmon lots of food to eat. Now they have so much energy to look after their family From the river to the ocean, getting bigger, growing strong Everybody's on a journey, come and join us and swim along From the river to the ocean, getting bigger, growing strong Everybody's on a journey, come and join us Swim along. Everybody's on a journey. Come and join us. Swim along. Way out to sea can be lonely on a rock all on your own. But a harbor seal likes the quiet of being alone. Far away we can hear her singing her favorite song ar, ar, ar. Is the sound of a harbor seal superstar. superstar She's a superstar If you listen you can hear her singing from afar Far, far, singing from afar Singing loud, singing proud She's a harbor seal superstar Look at her spotted body and her V-shaped nose. Her V-shaped nose. She looks so friendly, but prefers to be on her own. Prefers to be on her own. And far away we can hear her singing her favorite song. Or, or, or. Is the sound of a harbor seal superstar? Deep seas to coral reefs From the bottom 
Around the world these orca whales don't stop Exploring, caring for each other Just like us they stick together Her bill as a tool. Wow. Peck, 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 peck. What can she feel using her bill? Peck, 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 peck. In the mud and sand, we look around for little creatures. What have you found? Shells and stones. Fish drift would too. What can we find in the sand? Look at this. Digging, digging, digging around. What have you found as you dig in sand? Digging, digging, digging around. What can we find in the sand? Wow, look what the sandpipers found. Her bill as a tool. Yum, 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 yum. We explored and searched. We had so much fun. Yum, 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 yummy, yum, yum, yum. Peck, 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 peck. Digging, digging. Do you, you, you like to eat? eat, eat. We know you're, you're, you're an herbivore, vor, vor, grazing on, on, on the ocean floor. Manatees chew on seagrass like cows under the sea. That means they're an herbivore because they don't eat meat. Get strong, chew, chew, chew. We can try good food too. Manatee, tea, tea. swimming free, free, free. What do you, you, you like to eat? eat, eat. We know you're, you're, you're an herbivore, vor, vor. grazing on, on, on the ocean floor. Which fruit should we try next? I like greens and broccoli Bananas are the best Big and strong Chew, chew, chew Healthy food is good for you Manatee Swimming free What do you Do you know the great white shark has teeth in rows? Whoa. 
One, two, three, four, five. That's four more rows than you and I. Deep down in the sea, the great white shark has lots of teeth. Wow, look over there. Using gills to breathe, they can swim strong and free. Shark has lots of teeth. So many teeth. Grin wide as can be. Big smile, say cheese. Ocean explorers, can you see? The great white shark has pointy teeth. Whoa. Just like triangles in their mouths, and they grow back if they fall out. Deep down in the sea, the great white shark has lots of teeth. The great white shark has lots of teeth. Using gills to breathe, they can swim strong and free. Shark has lots of teeth. Grin wide as can be. Big smile, say cheese. Let's dance and count under the waves. There's a party happening today It looks dark, but what's that glow? Those creatures are shining, come on, let's go Come on, let's glow A sea warm glow, a sea warm glow It's a party on the ocean floor Look at those lights, how many can you see? One, two, and three Glow, let's glow Come on, everyone! Their friends are here What a sight! Bioluminescent wow. And bright The sea star puts on a show <laughs> And the jellyfish glow hey. Come on, let's glow Come on Jellyfish glow, Woo! jellyfish glow It's a party on the ocean floor Look at those lights, how many can you see? One, two, and three Glow, let's, let's shine together Dancing all day Let's shine Together we can light up the way Starfish glow, starfish glow It's a party on the ocean floor Look at those lights, how many can you see? One, two, and three Glow, let's glow
walks this electric he lives at the bottom of the river his body is made of electricity so when it's dark he can still slither what's this shape a square what's this shape a triangle isn't this great finding all the shapes light up light up What's this shape? A rectangle. What's this shape? A circle. This shape looks the best to curl up and rest. on singing to say hello it's such a long way for them to go thousands of miles across the oceans humpback whales are migrating this means they travel to find the warm sea and meet their friends and family out in the ocean, way down below The humpback whales are coming home They keep on singing to say hello It's such a long way for them to go All together it's time to feed Humpback whales get so hungry They can fit so much food inside By opening their mouths so wide Out in the ocean 
way down below The humpback whales are coming home They keep on singing to say hello It's such a long way for them to go They keep on singing to say hello And now they are
love to camouflage They can hide wherever they are Look at that stone, did it just move? Look closer Frogfish, we found you We're playing hide and seek in the tropical sea Where could all those frogfish be? They're hard to be seen Orange and green, can you find them? Let's see We're playing hide and seek in the tropical sea Where could all those frogfish be? They're hard to be seen Orange and green, can you find them? Well, let's see Frogfish have a great disguise The bodies help them blend in and hide Wait, look, there's some coral Did it blink? Look closer Frogfish, wow, do you win? Woo! We're playing hide and seek in the tropical sea Where could all those frogfish be? Woo! They're hard to be seen Orange and green, can you find them? Let's see We're playing hide and seek in the tropical sea Where could all those frogfish be? They're hard to be seen Orange and green Yes, you found them! So did we Hello, ocean explorers! Today, we're going to explore the incredible colors of the ocean and see some animals in their homes. Do you want to come along? All right! Explorer friends, how are you? Come along with us and we'll learn something new. I can't wait to see what a home in the ocean looks like. Me too. I don't just want to see the underwater houses. I want to see the underwater schools and the underwater swimming pools. I love that you're excited, Dean. I don't know if we'll see all of those things, but if we take a closer look, I bet we'll learn a lot. I can't wait. Me too. What about you? Do you want to take a closer look? When you're feeling curious and you want to know Take a closer look and your mind will grow Wow, those colors and shapes are so different and beautiful But what am I looking at? That's a coral reef So a coral reef is a group of colorful rocks? It looks like a group of colorful rocks but actually, the reef is made up of small living animals called coral. Whoa! That's cool! That purple coral looks like a bunch of purple tubes. And that yellow coral looks like a forest of yellow trees. <laughs> that pink coral is pointy like a pointy pink porcupine. All of that coral is so beautiful, but I thought we were seeing homes where ocean animals live. The coral is where lots of ocean animals live. It is. Follow me. I'll show you. Yay! Opus is going to show us where animals live in the coral. Let's go. If we pay close attention, I bet we can see some of the animals that live in the coral reef. Do you want to try? OK, let's go. Go. Oh, that was a sea urchin. Did you see it? That was a clownfish. Did you see it? Hey, look. I'm pretty sure we found the seahorse's home. Way to go, Dean. What are they doing with that coral? They're hanging on to it to protect themselves from being washed away by the strong waters. I wonder what seahorses eat. They eat tiny shrimp all day long. Oh, that's a lot of shrimp. But do you want to know what I think is the most interesting thing about seahorses? Daddy seahorses are the ones who have babies, not mommy seahorses. If you're a tiny horse who lives in water, anything is possible. Well, they're not actually horses, Dean. I'm going to need you to repeat that, Cal. OK. They're not actually horses, Dean. Whoa. 
See that fish over there? Look at those flaps on its neck. Those are called gills. That's how a fish breathes underwater. Now, look at the seahorses. <gasps> they have gills too! That's right, because seahorses are actually a type of fish. Oh, I love seahorses. I mean, sea fish. Uh, uh, horse horses. Uh, horse fish. Uh, you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Move like a seahorse, go up, go down. Move like a seahorse, sway side to side. Just feel the music, let it be your guide. Sway to and fro Dancing like the seahorses down below What a great day! We saw all sorts of colorful coral We learned about some animals who live in coral And we even got to see seahorses And we learned that daddy seahorses have babies it's pretty amazing, isn't it, Dean? Uh, yeah. Well, I guess there's only one thing left to do. Dance, Dance party! party! What a day, what a day. It's so much fun. Playing with friends by the ocean. Down below in the water. Up on the shore. So much to learn. So much to explore. We're so glad you could play with us. Tinker, Cow, Dean, Neptune, and Opus. What a day! What a day! It's so much fun. Playing with friends by the ocean. Working together Wash, wash, wash Working together Wipe, wipe, wipe Keeping it clean Down under the sea Making the dream work Using our teamwork A clownfish clean up Get ready to go Here are the things You need to know We live inside The end And you help me Working together Wash, wash, wash Working together Wipe, wipe, wipe Keeping it clean Down under the sea Making the dream work Using our teamwork A clownfish clean up All over the place We keep it clean and they keep us safe Just like best friends Together forever We're staying healthy Let's work together Working together Wash, wash, wash Working together Wipe, wipe, wipe Keeping it clean Down under the sea Making the dream work Using our teamwork Working together Wash, wash, wash Working together Wipe, wipe, wipe Keeping it clean Down under the sea Making the dream work Using our teamwork
One, two, three, four. This one has so many more. You, you, you are special. You, you, you are special. You, you, you are special. Yes, you are unique. You have spots going up and down. And you have lines going round and round. There's a different mark on every shot. And that's what makes you, 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 you. Every shark can look different Cause they are all not the same we'll Find the spots, let's play connect the dots Wow, that's great! Look at the pattern they make! They like to swim When the ocean's warm And we like to count their spots One, two, three, four You, you, you are special You, you, you are special You Yes, you are unique You have spots going up and down And you have lines going round and round There's a different mark on every shark And that's what makes you, 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 you is called a school they swim together looking cool can you help us choose which school they're in great let's go green or blue green or blue let's take a look which one are you green or blue green or blue we can help you to get back to school this one is green can you see their yellow they almost look the same But we need to find a difference Let's turn it into a game Some have blue fins, some have green fins Their colors say which schools they're in Don't stop now, the sorting's almost done Let's go! Green or blue, green or blue Let's take a look, which one are you? Let's take a look, which one are you? Green or blue, green or blue We can help you to get back to school This one is blue Now all the fish are back to school Hi, I'm Cal Together, my friends and I explore the wonders of the ocean Hi, I'm Tinker. It's so nice to see you. <laughs> we were just wondering what colors we can find on fish in the ocean. Hi, I'm Dean. Want to explore with us? Fantastic! Fantastic. Explorer friends, how are you? Come along with us and we'll learn something new. Guys. Hi, Opus. Hi, Neptune. I think I found some colorful fish. Wow, look at all the different kinds of fish. And all the different colors. This is great. Now we can explore the different colors of the fish in the ocean. Want to help us name the colors? Let's do it. What color is the trumpet fish? All right, the trumpet fish is yellow. It's actually long and yellow, like a banana. I wish I had a banana. Wait, I do have a banana. <laughs> now, what color is the clownfish? The clownfish is orange. 
just like me. Whoa, you and the clownfish are the same color, Tinker. That's awesome. Oh, 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 look at that fish. It's purple. Great try, Neptune. Want to try again? Uh, is it blue? Hmm. Yes, it is blue. Way to go. That fish is a blue tank fish. Sometimes I get my colors confused. We're all still learning, finding our way. Trying and smiling, getting better each day. Hey, it looks like the fish are looking for something. Hmm. Do you think they're hungry? I think they are. Ooh, my aunt packed me lots of other snacks too. More bananas, apples, crackers, cheese. It's so nice of you to want to share, Dean. But I don't think fish eat those foods. Are you sure? Don't tell my aunt. So, what do fish eat? Why don't we take, take a, a closer, closer look? look? When you're feeling curious and you want to know, take a closer look and your mind will grow. Fish eat food like algae, other little fish, and sea plants. Those sea plants right there are called seaweed. They look like long leaves and they sway underwater like this. Can you sway like the seaweed? That was fun! So, now that we know what fish eat, let's feed them! Yeah! Okay! What should we feed the fish? Bananas or seaweed? Seaweed! That's right! Blue tang fish. Time for lunch. You remembered blue, Neptune. Look what's happening. When the food goes in the water... The fish get excited and gather around to eat. Great job, ocean explorers! We named the colors of different fish, and we even figured out what some of them like to eat. Well, I guess there's only one thing left to do. Dance, Dance party! party. <laughs> what a day, what a day! It's so much fun! Playing with friends by the ocean! Down below in the water, up on the shore! So much to learn, so much to explore. We're so glad you could play with us. Tinker, Cal, Dean, Neptune, and Opus. What a day! What a day! It's so much fun. Playing with friends by the ocean. Well, ahoy there, ocean explorers. You're just in time. We're about to head down under the water. Want to explore with us? All right, let's go. Guys, guys, you know how Opus has eight arms? You mean these? One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight arms that he uses to swim around the ocean? Exactly. Well, I just saw another animal out in the ocean that also has lots of long, wiggly arms. Do you think it's also an octopus? Maybe. Well, maybe not. Is there such a thing as an octopus with lots and lots of arms? That sounds really interesting, Dean. Can I take a look through the periscope to see what you're seeing? What about you? Do you want to? Take, take a, a closer, closer look. look! When you're feeling curious and you want to know, take a closer look and your mind will grow! See? There it is! Just look at all those arms! So, what do you think? Is it an octopus? Even though it has a lot of arms, it's not an octopus. 
But you don't have to take my word for it. Let's ask our octopus friend, Opus. Hi, guys. You find anything interesting in the ocean today? We sure did. We saw an animal that has lots of arms, just like you, Opus. And it's right there. Oh, that's my friend. Hi, Janet. Hi, Opus. Janet is not an octopus. But what about all those arms? Her long, wiggly arms are actually called tentacles. They help her eat and swim. And that's also what my eight arms are called. My tentacles help me eat and swim too. But Janet has so many more tentacles than you. That's true. We're also different in other ways. Like how Janet's body is glowing? That's a great example, Dean. Janet's body can glow in the dark. Can you spot another way Opus and Janet are different? I noticed that Opus and Janet are different colors. Great observation, Tinker. Opus is blue and Janet is pink and purple. We're different sizes, too. That's true, Opus. You are bigger than Janet. So, what are you, Janet? I'm a jellyfish. I glow, and I'm smaller than an octopus, but I also have lots of tentacles to help me move through the water, like this. Oh, that looks like fun. I want to wiggle like a jellyfish. Me too. Do you want to wiggle like a jellyfish with us? Awesome, here we go. Come on, everybody, do the jellyfish wiggle. You twist all around and you wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. You shake it to the ground and you wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. You jump up and down and you wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. And that's how you do the jellyfish wiggle. That was fun. Nothing like shaking my tentacles. Um, Dean, you don't have tentacles. I don't? Dogs have legs, just like tigers and caterpillars. And sea turtles? Actually, I don't have legs or tentacles. I have flippers. Wow. What an amazing day. We learned about a new type of ocean animal that looks kind of like an octopus and has tentacles, but can glow in the dark. A jellyfish. And we noticed that some of us have arms, and some of us have tentacles, and some of us have flippers. And some of us have legs. And do you know what my legs love to do? What? what? Dance! What a day, what a day. It's so much fun. Playing with friends by the ocean. Down below in the water, up on the shore. Fun playing with friends by the ocean. It's time to make a change. Keep moving on. Let's find you a bigger home. Try some on for size. Then you can. Right.
become someone new. Hermit crabs pass on their old homes too. Explorers, you're just in time. We're looking for a good spot to go for a dive today. Do you want to come? All right! Explorer friends, how are you? Come along with us and we'll learn something new. Hey, Cal, how come you called it a dive instead of a swim? Great question, Dean. A dive is a swim, but when you dive, you go down deeper into the water to explore what's going on underwater. Come on, our friends Opus and Neptune are waiting for us down below. Hi, Hi Opus. Opus! Hi, Hi Neptune. Neptune! Hey everyone! You guys got here just in time. In time for what? <gasps> We're watching an octopus change colors. Whoa, what and how and what color was it and what color did it turn into? And is that even really possible? Oh, I have so many questions. Well, you're in luck, Dean, because I'm an octopus, so I have answers. Phew. We octopuses can change our color to match the color of whatever's around us. It's called camouflage. I get it! I think? Actually, maybe I don't get it. I think it might be easier to understand if we... Take, take a, a closer, closer look. look! When you're feeling curious and you want to know, take a closer look and your mind <laughs> that octopus is playing underwater hide-and-seek. So, camouflage means hide-and-seek? Not exactly, Dean. Camouflage is when you blend in to the colors of the world around you. So, it's sort of like a way to hide without a hiding spot. Just like that octo guy over there. That octopus changed from red to yellow to match the color of the sand. Wow, playing hide and seek with octopuses is so much fun. It sure is. Do you want to help us find an octopus? All right, let's do it. I spy a purple octopus. Can you find it? Yeah. The purple octopus is hiding behind the purple shell. They match. Let's see if we can find another one. Great idea, Tinker. Ready? Here we go. I spy a gray octopus. Can you find it? All right. The gray octopus is hiding on top of the gray rock. They match. It's octopus hide and seek. If you're the seeker, remember, don't peek. If you're the one they have to find, find something to hide behind. Be like an octopus and blend in well. So where you are, no one can tell. Move around, stand still. Find a hiding spot. Find a plant, or a door, or maybe a rock. I'm counting down from ten to one. Ready or not, here I come. Oh, oh, I spy a yellow octopus next to that yellow coral. Gotcha! <laughs> 
I want to see if I can hide like an octopus too. Watch me. Oh, way to go, Neptune. You totally matched that seaweed. Wait, did Neptune just become an octopus? This is big. No, Dean, I was <laughs> just joking around. I didn't really change color. I'm always green, like the seaweed. <laughs> <laughs> Today, we went diving deep into the ocean water, where we learned how octopuses hide by changing color to match the world around them. It was so much fun showing you guys how we octopuses play hide and seek, but you know, there is one thing we like to do even more. What's that, Opus? Dance! What a day, what a day, it's so much fun. Playing with friends by the ocean. Down below in the water, up on the shore. So much to learn, so much to explore. Ocean explorers, it's such a beautiful day that Neptune invited us all out to his favorite spot along the shore for some beach fun. Want to come explore the beach with us? Fantastic! Explorer friends, how are you? Come along with us and we'll learn something new. Hey guys, is this great or what? It sure is, Neptune. I love spending time outside in the warm sun. And I love playing in the sand. Oh, I love the sun in the sand too, but my favorite part of the beach is the waves. Surf, surf! <laughs> Come on, guys. Come swim with me. Okay, Dean. Here we, whoa! What's swimming out there? Are those seals? They have little black noses and they look really furry. I don't think those are seals, Neptune. <gasps> and what are they? There's one way to find out for sure. Want to take, take a closer look? look. When you're feeling curious and you want to know, take a closer look and your mind will grow. Wow, two otters. Otters, cool. What are they doing? They're playing. Otters love playing with their friends, just like we do. Look, they're coming in closer. Hey, where'd they go? Whoa, did that otter just use a rock to open a clam? He did, Neptune. Otters are one of the few mammals that use tools. <laughs> just like me. Exactly, but instead of using a tool belt to hold its hammer, an otter has a pocket under its arm where it keeps its favorite rock. How do you think they find all of those clams down there? Great question, Dean. Otters can smell underwater. No way. Oh, I wonder if I can smell underwater. Dean, I don't think I... <laughs> nope, can't smell underwater. Look at what that otter's doing now. It's stacking clams. That looks fun. 
I want to try stacking too. Great idea, Tinker. Let's see if we can find things on the beach that we can stack. I'm going to stack shells. I'm going to stack sand dollars. Oh, I'm going to stack driftwood. And I'm going to stack rocks. Are you ready to make stacks with us? Should we do what the otters do and put the biggest items on the bottom of our stacks? if I stack my stack small to big instead of big to small. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Well, I guess it doesn't last very long. Whoa, that was so cool. Hey, what's wrong, buddy? When the wave came in, it knocked over all our stacks. I didn't expect that to happen. That big wave really surprised me too. But now, we get to build more stacks. And we can make them even taller this time. Biggest on the bottom, smallest on the top. Shell stacks, crab stacks, wood stacks, rock stacks. Biggest on the bottom, smallest on the top. Short stacks, tall stacks, old stacks, new stacks, higher and higher and if they all drop, we'll just pick them up and build back to the top. Biggest on the bottom, smallest on the top. Oh, hey, look, the otters are holding hands and floating together now. That's because they're asleep. Otters hold hands when they sleep, so they don't drift apart. <laughs> Aww, that, that is, is so cute. cute. We learned so much about otters today. They have pockets, they use tools, they can smell underwater, and they're great stackers. I have one more question about otters. Sure, what's that, Dean? Do otters... Dance? I don't know, but I know a group of animals who do. Dance, Dance party! party. <laughs> what a day, what a day. It's so much fun. Playing with friends by the ocean. Down below in the water, up on the shore. So much to learn, so much to explore. It's so much fun playing with friends by the ocean. Working together, wash, wash, wash. Working together, wipe, wipe, wipe. Keeping it clean down under the sea. Making the dream work using our teamwork. Clean up, get ready to go Here are the things you need to know We live inside the anemone So I help you, and you help me yeah! Working together, wash, wash, wash Working together, wipe, wipe, wipe Let's work together. 